This is Mitchell Zoller from Global Medical News Network. I'm at the annual European Society of Cardiology Congress in Paris speaking to Dr. Yui Zeimer, who is a interventional cardiologist at the Institute for MI Research in Ludwigshafen, Germany. Um, and uh, Dr. Zeimer is commenting on a study presented this morning uh, that uh, in Japan that compared uh, Everlo Everolimus and Sirolimus eluding stents. Um, and uh, Dr. Zeimer, uh, what did you see as the significance of that comparison? I think still the size of the Sirolimus eluting stent is a standard of care because it was the first on the market. We have a lot of randomized trials. We have a lot of registries showing that it's safe and, if, and very effective. And now we have uh, r the reassuring um, result of this trial that we have a second volumous eluting stand which is as safe and as good as a standard of care which is a cipher stand. Yes, and you, you were telling me that actually the um, the reason why uh, currently the Everolimus eluting stent in Germany and elsewhere in the world has really become the most widely used stent uh, for coronary interventions, but that's largely been driven by the um, deliverability of the stent, its ease of use, not so much the uh, efficacy and safety uh, effects of the stent? Yes, clearly if you if you uh, talk with interventionalists they will tell you that it's uh, easier to deliver compared to the Zerolimus stand. So the platform of the Eolimus eluting stand is better. So people uh, like it more because it's easier in the cath lab to uh, implant the stand. But what we would like to know is if it's as effective as the cipher stand and as safe as the cipher stand. And now we have uh, uh, another randomized trial showing that it's uh, very safe and that it's effective in reducing uh, target vessel revascularization. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And this was actually the first direct comparison of the two kinds of stents and hence this is a, a kind of notable finding. Uh, clearly. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much uh, for Global Medical News Network. This is Mitchell Zoller.